Hey, what's up, guys? This is Ricky V. And today we're going to talk about 7-O-X-O DHEA or 7-Keto uh, DHEA, as is also well known. I'm sure that by now you've already heard the episodes that I did on 1 DHEA and 4 uh, DHEA. Well, this is 7-Keto DHEA. Very, very different from those other two. You see, when it comes to 7-Keto or a 7-O-X-O, as it's been known recently, you're not looking for it to attach to androgen receptors. As a matter of fact, 7-O-X-O DHEA has no effects on the androgen receptor that, that we can that we know of right now, at least. No, the effects of 7-Keto DHEA or 7-Oxo DHEA, I'm going to keep saying both names here throughout the, the episode. No, the effects are going to be on the way your body spends calories. It doesn't use the androgen pathway. I also have some uh, suspicions as to uh, other effects um, some of its metabolites might be having. So uh, stick around with me for this one. This is not going to be a long one at all. 7-Keto DHEA is pretty straightforward, and I'll tell you exactly how to use it. But uh, for now, let's start with uh, some of the studies. PMID 15910167, steroids and thermogenesis. Uh, for this one, we're going to go right to the paper, guys. We'll have a link to the paper right on the description of uh, this episode. But the mini review of uh, steroids and thermogenesis, volume 55, page 128, it says, it may thus be concluded that 7-Oxo DHEA is a potent thermomodulating agent, the final effect of which is comparable with thyroid hormones. Besides this, it is a precursor for other potentially beneficial steroids, thus rendering it one of the prospective candidates of steroid replacement therapy. Uh, there are other studies out there like uh, PMID 17418559 where uh, they found that 7-keto is beneficial for uh, uh, people overweight that are trying to lose weight. And when you uh, restrict calories, your resting metabolic rate slows down. And 7-keto was able to uh, bring it up on people dieting. 7-keto DHEA is just a really interesting drug for anybody that is trying to lose weight and doesn't want any, any side effects. I mean, women can use 7-keto DHEA, lots of it, and never have to worry about having any side effects uh, like growing a mustache uh, like you might have with some of the stronger androgenic anabolics. Now, just because 7-keto doesn't have androgenic effects, it doesn't mean it's kept the World Anti-Doping Agency, or WADA, from banning its use in competition. So yes, the WADA does list 7-keto DHEA as a prohibited anabolic agent. Even the FDA has proposed that it be banned from compounded drugs. It is an effective compound that creates real effects in the body of those people that use it. There are some mechanisms of 7-keto uh, DHEA we might, we might just not know well yet. There is a, a study where, uh, where a conversion from 7-keto DHEA to a remistane was found. Now, remistane is a pretty potent anti-estrogen. The guys in the study theorized that the arimistane might have came from the way that the sample was, was prepared and not an actual conversion that would occur naturally in our body. But it's just interesting that arimistane can even be a metabolite in your body from ingesting 7-keto DHEA. That means that 7-keto DHEA could somewhat work as a, as a bit of an anti-estrogen and maybe is one of the reasons uh, people find it easier to get leaner while taking 7 OXO. I don't know. There's a lot of real interesting questions that can be raised by putting all of these different studies together. And one thing is for sure, 7-Keto is here to stay. There are a ton of products on the market right now that use 7-Keto. Everything from over-the-counter uh, weight loss pills for your grandmammy to some really hardcore supplements for bros like you and me that are using 7-Keto along with anabolic androgenic agents. And this brings us to the reason we're here today, Vintage Muscle that's vintage-muscle.com. When you go to vintage-muscle.com, click on the Buy Now button. Scroll down to Hydroxygenin. Hydroxygenin is the product you want. This is the one that contains 7-Oxo DHEA, 200 milligrams. Now, this is a full formula. It doesn't just contain the 7-Oxo. It has laxogenin. I did a whole video on that. It has acusatin. I did a whole video on that one as well. 7-Oxo, which we're discussing today. And the real powerful T2, the 3,5 Diodo L Thyronine, 200 micrograms. That one, we only need micrograms. is very, very strong. Hydroxygenin is a really strong combination of fat loss agents. 
You're going to be able to maintain some good muscle mass and burn body fat quite quickly when using hydroxygenin. Because of the T2 in the suspension, there are uh, some precautions you have to take with it. Uh, you might not want to use this one for more than about four weeks at a time. And it really stacks well with one DHEA. Uh, you can stack it with four DHEA. You can run it along with uh, a nice stack of uh, one DHEA, 19 nor uh, DHEA, and the hydroxygenin. Uh, you could take it with the wind test. Uh, really, you have a lot of options and a lot of different ways you can stack this one. Hydroxygenin has become one of the favorite products among the vintage muscle members that are looking to cut down on body fat. Head over to vintage-muscle.com and click on the community link. This will take you to the vintage muscle community. Make sure to create a new post and let everyone know you just picked up a bottle of hydroxygenin and ask everyone what the best way to use it is. You'll get answers from real users, real guys that are using this product today right now. This is a really good one. Hydroxygenin is very, very strong. Like I said earlier, you do not want to use it for more than four weeks. That uh, T2 hormone is, is quite strong and you want to make sure to use it with caution. If you use it for four weeks, uh, make sure to get off of it for a few weeks as well. Hydroxygenin is a loaded fat loss product. Guys, that is it for me today. I told you this would be a short one. Join me in future videos where I will be telling you all about T2, how it works, and why it's such a crucial component to the hydroxygenin formula. I'll also be telling you about several other vintage muscle products and ingredients that you can add to your regimen right now. So make sure to subscribe and stay tuned for our next episode. That's it for me today. This is Ricky V. Rock signing out.